So here we are for another hunt. This time it will be Toby Kadachi. Toby Kadachi was the first monster that carted me in Rise because I was not ready for Thunderblight and being more prone to being stunned. So this will be the first time that I'm fighting Toby Kadachi without full stun resistance. So let's see how it goes. I'd wager that I may cart once in this hunt. So there he is, flying around, he's a very nimble boy. I don't like to fight him that much. I like to fight him with a lance. Poke, 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 poke. With a great sword. Not so much, but let's go. Let's go for an early knockdown, but all misses. One thing in this game and um, uh, in this map, there are some zones that are very, very tight. You have very little room to, to maneuver. Well, stunned already. Let's hope he doesn't smack me with his tail and cart me. Okay, we're safe. How was this quest called? Flying Sparks? Yeah, it makes sense. There he is, not, not quite flying. Now he's flying. Then the rice tail. Head. I always thought this monster looked like a, a cross between a flying squirrel and a snake. Maybe that's what it actually is. Squirrel snake. Right. Be careful. You'll get stunned more easily now. Let's go for that new berry, done. I'm just running around. I don't remember if uh, his tail is, bra is breakable or uh, severable. Maybe it's just breakable. Don't remember. By his size, I'd say it's only breakable. But Puke Puke is also a very small monster and the tail is severable. So this is the item I gained from the other quest, it's a mantle. It gives you, apparently, um, invisibility until you attack or take damage. Or stealth, more. Than invisibility. Invisibility was the wrong word. But the monster doesn't detect you unless you attack him or you take damage. Then it has a cooldown. I'm not sure how long it was. Maybe it's like from three to five minutes, from what I recall from the item description. So far so good, I have not been uh, punished hard for leaving the Thunderblight on. Uh, 
but I'm still running the ground a, a lot. Oof. So a little bite again. Well, now I'm just abusing the, the Clutch Claw with no real gain from it. And again, and stun. Now, this is the card, boys. What is he doing? Okay, we're safe. Is that a limp? No. Or he's just calmly walking away. Great Jaguar strolling by. He didn't seem to mind much with our passing. Okay, Thunderbite again. I think I'm just being lucky. Okay, knock down. Let's go. Let's punish the little squirrel snake. And at the same time, three Jaguars or two Jaguars. Oh no, three. Okay, maybe this is the guy that we will uh, kill with the Clutch Claw attack. Okay, let's take advantage of this. Um, no. A good hit. Okay, it's the advantage. Okay, there he is. Is this his final resting place? Okay, let's go. Bam! Can I grapple him while he's up there? And one. Ooh, he died. Nice. It wasn't that spectacular, but I'll take it. And here's the quest complete screen. See you next time.